Hey there, it's Grindfest once again and today we'll talk about Haven. Haven is an RPG from the developers of Fury, which was a fine fine game. You play as you and K, two lovers who have escaped from some sort of organization to an unknown world. You try to fix your vehicle and get the resources and food to survive at the beginning of the game. You can glide and drift when exploring, the movement is enjoyable. The game also involves a lot of things couples do in their daily lives. Cooking together, eating together, crafting together and stuff. The graphics are quite colorful and cartoony. Overall, it's nice to look at. The music is mostly chill electro tracks from what I've seen. It doesn't bother you or tire you up, it's just there in the background. As for the combat, it is real-time tactical combat, but it's also a bit like turn-based combat because you need to charge for a second or so before issuing an order. You can use impact, which is some sort of melee attack, blast, which is like, well, an energy blast, shield to reduce incoming damage or protect your partner and pacify to finish off weakened opponents. You can time your attacks with your partner for a different animation and it possibly adds an effect to your attack. From cooking to fighting, almost everything you succeed at will improve your chemistry relationship sort of score and that may also lead to bonus stats later on. Overall, I'm not very impressed by the combat for now, but that's just because while they nailed the sense of timing and combination, there are very few options to choose from. But I expect these are the basics of it and I hope it opens up as you progress. I mean, the sense of timing and combination is there, they just need to give us options. From what I've seen, the game is advertised as something you could play with a romantic partner. So, I wanna talk about that a little bit. Dialogue and behavior of the couple felt quite believable to me. The way you and K acts feels like a genuine couple, so props to the developers. There are dialogue choices for the couples as well, but that doesn't really enhance the couple experience in my opinion. Since there are two choices anyway and it's very likely that how your partner would respond isn't included among them. I've also tried this game with my wife and she couldn't get into the exploration and combat even with the combinations and all that. Probably because she mostly enjoys fighting and racing games. Anyway, my point is your partner or friend may not enjoy the game as you do. But the gameplay and story is quite enjoyable for a solo player as well. This game may or may not be your entry point to the gaming as couples. Like I said, if all else fails, you can just enjoy it yourself. Overall, these are my first impressions of this game. If you've enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to my channel. Let me know in the comments if you want me to review a specific game. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!